Okay, this is going to be a demonstration of the Life Shield laser uh, on how it has an effect upon our blood. If you take something toxic into your system, uh, there's a process known as Rouleau formation, which is a clumping of the blood cells, which occurs very frequently if you have a, uh, a toxic substance that you've ingested, or even if you breathe something in. If you smoke a cigarette, the cigarette smokers will develop a Rouleau formation. By using the Life Shield laser, uh, we can reverse this process. And you can see the blazer pen right there. Show it, Richard. And okay. this is actually microwave water that Rick is going to drink. And then we're going to test his blood and show the effects of microwave water. A sample of blood is going to be taken from Rick's finger and then put on a slide. And then we're going to take a look at this underneath the microscope to see what his, uh, what his blood reaction is. Now, what you're seeing now is a uh, rouleau formation in the red blood cells and this is the effect from drinking uh, microwave water. The same effect would occur if you smoked a cigarette, if you breathed a toxic substance in the air or any other toxic uh, substance that you would ingest in your body. This is typical of a rouleau formation. Now you're looking at Richard lasering the water with the Life Shield laser, the uh, pocket laser. All you need is about uh, four or five clockwise rotations of the laser into the water. Now Rich is going to take another blood sample from the finger and put it on the slide exactly as was done previously. Now this is a uh, blood sample taken immediately after he was given the lasered water. You can see the individual red blood cells are floating independently of one another. They're not clumped well, together. This was an imme immediate effect. Beautiful, beautiful uh, example of what occurs with the Life Shield laser.